What about spiritual ego? With a good teacher, they're going to cut that down right away. You know, just instantly slice through that. Slice through it over and over and over again until the person either goes and finds another teacher who will tell them that they're wonderful or they figure out how to let go of that and see through it, see the emptiness of it, deconstruct it, etc. What are some of your slicing techniques? It's not hard to trigger someone. Just a little bit, just a tiny bit, and then go, see that right there? You know, I mean, you can do that, you know, classic Asian spirituality way. You might do it in front of, in a bun in public, in front of a bunch of other students and really embarrass them and point to it. That's a little bit, in my opinion, you know, it's a little bit mean. Uh, but in one-on-one, -on -one, in a gentle way, you can do something like that and point to it and just say, you know, there's still some stuff to work on here. And then we move on. If they're saying, uh, I'm liberated in such a way that I will never get fixated or caught or triggered, uh, then, okay, well, let's find out. And so we find out <laughs> right away. Interesting.